Hey, my name is Michael and today I want to look at one of the barrel attachments for most weapons in Planet Sun 2. The attachment is the flash suppressor. Its benefits are described in one of Pharrell's videos that I will link down in the description. But today I want to look at the drawbacks of using this attachment. In the attachment description you can read that a flash suppressor decreases full auto accuracy, which makes burst firing necessary at extreme ranges. Now, for the weapons this attachment is available, you will most likely never fight at ranges over 200 meters, and at that range you already need to burst fire to be effective. I put together a comparison between a weapon with and without a flash suppressor and tested at approximately 20 meters if I could see any difference in the recoil pattern and accuracy. As you can see in these videos and pictures, there is a slight accuracy reduction even at close ranges, which will increase the further away your target is located. Testing this at longer ranges is hard and very inaccurate to do, so I decided to stick to this close range testing. On the left side you can see a weapon without the flash suppressor equipped, and on the right side you can see one with. Okay, so here's my opinion of this attachment. I think this attachment is best suited for close to medium range fighting, but it can be utilized at all ranges if you know how to handle and control your weapon. The positive sides definitely outweigh the negative ones. Buy this attachment for indirectly increased survivability, but keep in mind, as you saw in the comparisons, the accuracy reduction takes place already at close distances. I hope you liked this short video. Ratings and comments are appreciated. Thank you for watching.